bird on a tree. I'm just sitting here. I got time. Well, not every day is a good day for tourist. <laughs> it's windy, it's blowing, it's insane. And it's the biggest raindrops. You can't see them right now, but they were huge a minute ago. We thought we would bring you guys to Shoshone Falls. So we're going to probably sit in the camper just for a little bit till this uh, hopefully blows over. It's, um, it looks like it might. <laughs> well, the funny thing lack. is, the wind direction is coming from that way. Right. We'll see. All right. So as soon as it stops raining, we'll take you guys to the falls. All right. So Terry and I are here at Shoshone Falls. You see it right behind me. It's going to be really loud. So this is going to be more of a video of uh, checking things out really a bunch of yapping. We got here. See the weather behind me is kind of turning to uh, a lot of rain. And I have a jacket. So anyways, we'll go for a walk. Enjoy. Come over here and see what it looks like on this side. The further I walk this way, the better the better the view gets. It's amazing there's not a little boat down there that you can take a boat ride on. As you can see, they've uh, they cut this trail off. What a beautiful overlook that was. I was just watching and see how that land is over there. Yeah, I just came down. Did you did you see that? Yeah, as I was walking up. So these young people can walk up a cliff like that. Uh, not for me and Terry. Yeah, that was bizarre. Well, I don't know. I wouldn't be able to do that. Oh, okay. Maybe. I'm not sure. Not sure how we get over to here. I think there's a whole nother drive or a trail or something like that. Okay. There we go. We'll go up this way, she says. My flip-flops on. You do have your flip-flops on again. I do. Well, we weren't planning on going for a hike. We're just going to look at an awesome waterfall. It's quite the hill. So I assume your toes are squeezing so hard on those flip-flops. Yeah, huh. It almost wouldn't matter if it was raining or not up here because the water is... Uh, Still, the moisture is still coming up from the uh, falls. Yeah, it actually feels really good. It does feel good. And it looks like the rain that is on its way is actually blowing off to the side. So. And I'll say that now until we, all of a sudden we're getting drenched. So a few people have been walking back here and up and around so let's go see what they're doing um oh i see you can go way up there or you can just follow this this way i'm not sure 
Oh, it's a little mucky. I don't think we're gonna um, trample through that. Yeah. It looks like it's just a trail that goes right back down to the walkway. It looks like people got off the beaten path. They did. And made their own path. Yeah. <laughs> oh my but, God. But uh, <laughs> that I, when we were walking up here, I saw a um, otter, which is really kind of weird to me because the water's so far down there. But he's obviously got a trail to get down there, and he was big. Unfortunately, Scotty and I were both trying to get the cameras going so we didn't get a picture of him. He was a big fellow. All right. Well, hold my hand. You got tinnies on. I will. Just hang on to me. Don't let me slip. Oh, maybe I should get over here because these have the little steps in it. There. This uh, step is actually very um oh what somebody's getting her getting her pictures taken yeah this uh ground is not slick at all <laughs> watch as i go down my rear but i don't think so it's pretty um sticky on the bottom of your feet go up to the lake and see what's going on up there. So they have a nice little concession stand. They got pop and cheeses and DVDs sold here. T-shirts, magnets. Everything a tourist would want. And a little bit of food. Well, there's that little critter. Same type that I saw. Um, walk it. I don't know. Okay. This is the attempt to see what they actually are. We're going to get a little closer. Oh, yeah. He's looking like a groundhog the more I get close up here. I've never, no, nope, no. Nope. <laughs> he's really cute. Maybe he's telling us summer's on its way. I don't know. When I is mean, Groundhog Day? He's precious. Uh, Look at him. He's uh, all fuzzy. Oh my gosh. I'm in love. <laughs> he's so He looks so cuddly, Terry. I want to take him home. Until the fangs come out. Yeah. Then everything goes sideways. All right, that's as close as I can get to him. It's really cool. second or so and then his parachute deployed oh. and it was all over. So it looks like everybody uses this as the wishing well area. Not 
there is the prize, right? The yeah. Coin out there. I think so. So it must be little kids that barely drop them out of their hands. <laughs> they only get that far. They're pretty small, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> they really do. They do. They look tiny. But look at all the coins in that crevice right there. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's a lot. Some way over there in the middle. Oh, yeah. And just imagine yeah. how many have gone down in the water. <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that made it all the way down there. Wow. Right? All right. We are just about done here. And I think we're going to go up and check out the lake, which is right over there. Beautiful place. Yeah. For $5 for the day, you, can't you cannot go wrong. Go wrong. And I've seen more wildlife in this park than I have in the last couple states, that's for sure. There was a deer over here earlier. Uh, I didn't have the camera rolling, unfortunately. There's Dave and Bella. Super nice park. Well, this lake is not dog friendly, unfortunately. Uh, no alcohol beverages allowed, no glass containers allowed as well. We do have a wheelchair accessible area for parking. Well, the geese are down here. Lots of geese poo. Yeah. Um, but they got little goslins. Which look like they're growing pretty quickly. Yeah, they do. Oh, yeah, Mama I don't want. Eyeballing. I know. I don't want to get too close to her because she is on guard. Oh, I got a diving board. A little swimming area here. Oh, so I see you can walk around out there. Okay really pretty. So the falls are on that side over there. But it is. Are you, what are you standing in? I, I'm not standing in, but I'm looking at nut chuck poo. <laughs> now I know how much nut chuck poo and nut chuck could chuck <laughs> if he pooed right there. They poo all over here. It's all over That's the area. That's the pile of nut chuck poo. <laughs> I can see fresh stuff. So they must live in the rocks and everything here then. Wow. Hopefully they're not coming back soon. All right, well, we made it to Jerome County Fairgrounds. Over here, they have power and water for $10 a night. And when the office is open, they have free showers. So we did not have to travel that far. Jerome, I, I, I can't remember because I was doing a lot of stuff in the front of the car, truck when I, we were driving, so I want to say maybe 15 minutes from where we were, maybe 20. But anyways, it's a good place to park for the night, and <laughs> we've already got the heater plugged in and sucking power because it is 59 degrees here tonight. So anyways, this is where we'll be for... Uh, the evening um, from the parking lot if you walk around that building there is a box right over there on the door and it's on the honor system you go over there and there's you pull up this uh, little box lid and put your money in there they don't ask for any information they just uh, expect you to pay and I'm sure that the office when they open come out and they see how many vehicles here and how much money's in there so all right it's been a long day hope you guys enjoyed the falls and look at that sky that's beautiful I'll see you guys another day <laughs> <laughs>